Now to a KPVI exclusive. A house fire back in April left a Pocatello man homeless and the burnt remains have become an eyesore for local residents. We decided to investigate and learn something we never expected to. KPVI news that works for you reporter Andre Phillips made the discovery today. He joins us now in the studio. Andre. Thanks, guys. I recently told you about an abandoned building that became a breeding ground for crime. Since then, several Pocatello residents reached out to us and said they'd been dealing with a similar issue. Today, we checked it out. Boarded up windows, debris littering the front yard, and eyesore from the second you lay eyes on it. But neighbors say they've had to look at it like this for over two months. Disgrace. It's an eyesore. It needs to be leveled. It needs to be taken care of. Somebody needs to do something with it. This man who didn't want to be identified on camera says the house burnt down about two months ago. And he's called the police about a squatter living here. But as it turns out, the squatter, in fact, was the homeowner. Come to find out, the homeowner across the street said it was the owner of the property who was the squatter. And I thought, wow. You know, how, how can that happen? So we went to see if anyone was home. No luck. Neighbors say the man sleeps here every night and says he's lived in the house for over 15 years. They've offered to help him on numerous occasions and even reached out to the family with no luck. The city's code enforcement already has an open case out for the property. But among the other well-kept homes, it clearly stands out and neighbors are at a loss. The city needs to come in and take over the property, mm -hmm. destroy the house, mm -hmm. clean it up, and sell it.